you now go about turning good performances into, into three points? Um, well, you score goals at the end of that good performance. I mean, we uh, you don't win the league or, or games on stats, of course, but what we do know is we, we played the game that we wanted to play. We stopped their threats, which was good, kept the crowd quiet and moaning. Um, and we created opportunities for ourselves. And uh, the disappointment was, of course, that we just didn't take at least one of them. If we'd have took at least one of them, then we'd have been talking about a really good performance all round. And how do you now avoid frustration amongst the players? Because you said you, you played well against, against Stevenage as well. It's only really the, the free kick that meant yeah. you didn't pick up any points. So how do you avoid the player frustration now? Yeah, well, you have to avoid player frustration. What we have to do is, like we do in review, which we will do this morning on the Yeovil game, and we did against uh, in the Stevens game, it's just showing them what went well and what didn't go well. And uh, at the moment, there's more things going well without winning a game. Uh, so we have to make sure that we're not frustrated, they're not frustrated, even though as human beings we are, but as footballers and as a group, um, we've got to be seeing that we're, we're not far away. And at least we're, you know, we're not out there thinking where's our next point coming from, um, and we've got to make sure that we're not thinking where's our next goal coming from. But uh, you know, we'll work with them and we'll take away the frustration if we can by showing them that actually uh, all of them, nearly all of them, played their part in uh, in a good team performance. And Newport tomorrow then, and a game you drew both times last season and finish two points above in the league. Is that a good opportunity for you to compare this campaign to the last campaign and see where you are in relation? Uh, no, I don't, I don't think so. I think it's a, I think Newport are stronger than they were last year. Uh, they've had a good start um, and it will be a, a tough game because they are a tough team. You know, it's one of those teams that you, you have to go to and if you're anything short of 100% committed, uh, they can they can beat you, so we've got to make sure that we're we're nice and committed, nice and organised, and uh, make sure that you you're in the game for uh, as long as you can, and try and get your noses in front by hopefully getting the worst goal ever that have the ball crossing the line for a change. <laughs>